Hi everyone, Jason here. I'm back in my juicy kitchen. As always, thank you very much for your company. This is called Nourish. I was just about to say that I'm using the Nama J2 juicer. Well, I am and I'm not. What do I mean? If you've got one of these juicers, you know, you go, that's a different motor. Yes, that's because this is the Nama C2 because it has a blender and a juicer, and yet somehow the same motor does both. I'll show you how it's gonna work in a minute, but fantastic. But if you've got a fast juicer and a normal blender, then that all still works very well together. So we've got cucumber going into the recipe as well. We just need half a medium cucumber, and we're adding celery as well. Then of course, we've got the mineral rich power of raw broccoli, raw broccoli juice. You don't need a great deal of it. A floret like that, happy days in a slow juicer of any kind, or you can use the stem. I like the stem because it's mineral rich, it's all mineral rich, but there's, it's more dense inside the stem. And if you've got a fast juice, you're gonna get more juice from that. So I'm gonna stick with the stem, leave that to one side. We're gonna use a third of a lemon, but we're gonna leave the skin on, on this particular recipe. Why? If you get two apples and you get lemon with the rind on, if I was to put that, just that, through a juicer, then it tastes like sherbet dib dab lemonade. It is so nice, it's scary. So all we're doing is we're adding onto the lemonade really with these other flavors that can be a little bit bitter. So I'm gonna bunk everything in the juicer except the avocado. The avocado doesn't go in a juicer. You can't juice an avocado, but you can only blend an avocado. With this juicer, all of the softer produce must go in first. Why? Because gravity makes this beautiful machine works in terms of extracting the maximum juice. So we want the heavier on top. Now you can get the cucumber and put it in like that, but do you know what? You just, in terms of room, I find with the hopper, what you want to do is just make sure that you kind of just put them around, distribute it like that. Then you've got the lemon with the rind on, fantastic. Then you've got the celery going in. This is every single ingredient you know is just going to make those cells sing. Uh, with the apple, there's not enough room to put them in whole because you can just see they need to be tucked in a little bit on this particular recipe. So I'm deciding to cut them. So that's all good. We just close that. Yeah, we've got everything in. We just close that. And this machine's fantastic. You just turn it to the side, click a little button, let it do its thing, go away, go and do something else, come back and it'll make it for you. We haven't got time for that. So in the style of editing, or sorry, the beauty of editing, um, it will just, well, uh, well, sorry, in the, whatever it is. Uh, look, the magic of editing. And now we've got the beauty, look at that. All of that goodness in liquid form, bioavailable to every cell in the body. But we're not finished because we have the blender element here of the Nama C2. And again, if you've got a fast juicer, any regular blender will do, it doesn't matter. This happens to be the piece de resistance. Um, we're gonna add, I always like to add ice. One, it cools the juice down. If you have not vegetable juice, sometimes it's nice to just cool that down. But secondly, it just kind of waters it down a little bit when it comes to like avocado. So look, we've got avocado. It says a quarter of a medium avocado, which would be about that much there. Perfect, depends on the size of the avocado. I like just, cheeky a little bit more and and when you've got ice it won't go too thick okay and then we pour the juice into that and we're going to blend this really fast we don't want to blend it for too long at all now all we do is take this part of the machine off and then we just put the blender in its place there you go and then we just put the lid on always remember to put the lid on <laughs> Right, so it even says blend, which is nice. Turn to one side. I'm not going to blend it for long. Just give that a little kick. Allow it to do its thing. All right, it's enough. It's, en it's just doing its own thing now. I don't like to blend it for too long. Obviously, we've just done cold press juicing, so you don't want to then negate some of that by just blitzing the whole thing for like three minutes in a blender. Now, Alex, hopefully you're not getting this left-hand side thick. Have you seen the juice that's pouring there? And so we just pour that in. Oh, that looks good. That is the right consist. That's the key thing when it comes to any avocado-based smoothie mixed with vegetables is the consistency. Oh, because you've got the lemon in there, you can taste that, and you've got the base of the homemade lemonade. Absolutely fantastic. That's called nourish because it nourishes every single cell in your body. I am now gonna go and clean up. <laughs> I don't think that, there's no way out of this. I'm just gonna have to walk off because it's just, there's no way to finish this eloquently. <laughs> 